a 98 Dodge Ram uh, for a thousand bucks. What a deal, huh? I think it's a great, great deal. deal. So all we got to do to this thing, we got a couple of little peeling on the front end here, right? So all we're going to do, a lot of people think, you know, oh, I could just feather this out and put new clear coat on it. You know, you're going to be doing the same amount of prep work, same amount of time. You might as well lay a nice coat of paint on it because once you start feathering and sanding, you're going to get down to metal in some areas anyway. So the proper way to do it is to feather everything out. We're going to get some base coat, new base coat, lay the green on it, and then clear the whole front of the truck. So we're going to paint the fender, the hood. Come over here, we'll show you some dents we got. So it looks like it got hit in the front right here, right? So we're going to pull this grill off, take the dent out, bondo it up, and get that all flat. What I might do with this grill, I'm thinking we'll clean it up and we'll paint it a flat black. So all of this looks black in the front and it'll look really nice. So that's going to show the big dent in here. Yeah, this whole big dent we're going to pull out, we're going to bondo it, it's going to look like it was never hit before. A little high spot in here from the impact, but we're going to pound it all down, it's going to look all nice. And we have a little dent over here, all right? This is going to be really easy. Take me 20 minutes to take it out and put a coat of bondo on it. We're going to grind it, weld some pins in, pop it out. Uh, like I said, we're going to paint, paint the whole front here, and then the back. We got one more dent in the back here. We're gonna pull this dent out, do the body work, and then paint, basically paint the green from here up, base it, and clear, clear the side of the bed. And we're probably gonna do this little thing in the process while we're at it. Uh, and then this, we're just gonna get some touch up green and touch it up. And then buff the back out, it'll look nice. All right, so stay tuned for the project, and I will keep you posted. Oh, this guy's gonna do all the sanding work, by the way. I'm gonna teach him how to sand it. He's 75 years old. 76. He doesn't look it. This guy's as strong as an ox. I wish I, I'm in his condition at 76 years old, you know? So I'm gonna teach him. He's wearing my glasses so I don't look so old. I'm gonna teach him the body work and he's gonna sand it all down, get it ready, and we're gonna paint it. All right? Cheers. Dodge Ram Project. When the old climber starts doing his thing. I'm done. Then like this, yeah. you want to weld it in the crease. Okay. Then we're going to do like four or five of them. Right. So you're like that and then you got to push mm -hmm. until this outer edge hits the metal. Okay. Okay. And then you're going to squeeze the trigger for like couple of seconds, like two seconds, and then you pull out. It's pretty easy, right? First time. <laughs> Not too bad for a 76 year old. <laughs> Not too bad. <laughs> Push it in, you close it, but you keep pressure on it, because if you don't, it's gonna fall out, right? Watch. Keep the pressure on it. Yeah, you cut them off with dikes and then you grind it off. Grind okay. the uh, pins off. So. Like that. The high spot right in here okay so it got hit here and then it pushed everything high all right so we're gonna tap this down right now quickly and then we're gonna put pins all down in here and we're gonna put pins in all these areas over here okay Pretty cool. Okay, now we're gonna weld the pins in and start pulling everything out. 